Soft skills are absolutely essential to career success these days. I tell my students, your technical skill may help you get the job, but it's your soft skills that'll help you keep the job, and be successful on the job. So in the college classroom, we're using my portfolio projects for soft skills to help our students learn while they're learning about technology, how to use word processing appropriately as a soft skill written communication skill, how to use PowerPoint presentations as a way to effectively communicate a message to a group, how to use collaboration tools, digital collaboration tools that we're already teaching, but we give a realistic scenario to the students so that they can learn about team dynamics, how to get work done in a group. Because guess what? In the workplace, we work on teams. We work with other people. We don't work in isolation. So we actually, in the course of teaching word processing, Excel spreadsheets, PowerPoint presentations, and the like, we're using soft skills as the foundation for learning those skills so that they can see in context, oh, when I write this report and I need to collaborate with other people, I can use the review tools. I can use these mechanisms, and that's something that will carry over to the workplace. Or when I do a presentation, oh, maybe I should think about embedding a video. Oh, here's a skill we can use. So we're really teaching them what we're already doing in the course, we're just putting the soft skills in as the sort of the dressing on it, if you will, the clothes on it, so that the student can look at it and say, you know what, I see the relevance of this now. This makes sense and these are skills I can use. When we infuse soft skills into the skill sets that we're teaching, the student comes out not only with the technical ability, but they have the soft skills, the personal skills, to wrap around it and package and present to the world. That's a win-win.